Ginger Jester. All right, so we have to go back to the Earth Shrine. I guess. Go figure, the, ca the Cavern of Earth would unlock the thing in the Earth Gift Shrine. Yeah. So how do we get there? With this port? Uh, maybe. Depending on if that's mountains or swamp. I know, the coloration <laughs> is like near identical. Oh right, I know it was this way because we're on the Isle of Dorito. Yeah. The Doritan Peninsula. Yeah. <laughs> what are these jokesters? <laughs> Alright, I want to play this game, but I want all the songs as sang by K.K. Slider. Ah, I was hoping you were going to say Manny. <laughs> I feel like everyone who has not seen Swiss Army Man is not going to get the reference. Of course not. But I am it's not... A reference. In, to Swiss Army Man. In good conscience, I cannot tell them all to go watch it. Because <laughs> that movie has scarred me for life. I can tell people to watch it in good conscience, because it's a fantastic movie. It's got a good heart. And How? boner. <laughs> How do you explain that movie in 30 seconds to someone who has never seen it before? Um, like... Well, it's a movie where uh, Daniel Radcliffe has a uh, ferromagnetic boner so that he works like a compass, but also he's dead, but also he's living, but also he spits water because he's a squirtle, but also you... he has gas. Hey, kids, do you want to see Harry Potter in his next big role? Check us <laughs> 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 Oh my god! I just like. <laughs> I like. I just picture like my twelve-year-old sister who's reading the Harry Potter books, hearing that and going to watch it. Take out Swiss Army Man. <laughs> oh, that's so Where cool. Harry Potter that's is a so fighting gross. corpse with a magical compass. <laughs> that's so <laughs> gross. Oh. He saves the lives of at least one person oh, that's and the so hearts raunchy. of everyone else. <laughs> that's so gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. My favorite part was looking over and seeing Wifey just like. Shaking her head maniacally, she's like, "No, right. do not." <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so wrong. Uh, okay, so it's it's yeah. Enjoy that. Weirdly, not like a square on the map. I know. I was just thinking that. <laughs> yeah, I can't yeah. get through here because there's mountains. So, well, you can always go back to Cornwall. Cornwall. Corningware. Corn beef hash. <laughs> it's another one. It's corn beef hash. I'm gonna see if they have ether. Oh, we should have got corn beef. <laughs> we should get corn beef next time and then make corn beef hash. Talk to Dancer! Hey, Star Bootylicious. How's it going? Hi there. I'm a dancer. What's that? You want to dance with me? <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you. How about we have that dance? What do you say? I feel like the longer that went on, the more I wanted to give her, like, a Boston accent. <laughs> Wanna have that dance now? What do you say? <laughs> Wanna have that dance now? What? I don't know why what was going to do this um, um, I'm going to stock up on some Phoenix Downs, because, I mean, I got the money. <clears throat> and I've got the lack of talent it requires to need Phoenix Downs by the dozen. <laughs> Phoenix Downs with their new album, By the Dozen. Oh. I'm Phoenix and these are the Downs. <laughs> we are Phoenix and the Downs. One, two, three, four. Like, <laughs> no. Right. Is that the up? drummer a down two? <laughs> I was gonna say that. Is that up a down two? <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, Wallace. Wallace is my spirit animal. Wallace is the best character. Probably ever. When we play the, the game, who are we gonna be? Because we can only pick one character. You, you gotta commit to one character for the whole playthrough. Because of the level up system, mm. right? Mm. I'm not being dramatic like you. So who is it? Scott, There's... Ramona, Knives, and Wallace? Scott, Ramona, uh, Steven Stills, and Kim are the default four. And then uh, Wallace and Knives are DLC, which I have. Oh, I can't decide. I love them all so much. I really want to be Knives. Oh, really? I played Scott originally, and he's he's like the Mario, you know? Like, he's really good at everything. It's me! But he's kind of boring at the same time. Scott Pilgrim! But I paid money for Knives, <laughs> and I never got to play as her, so... See, I really like Knives. I'm, like, reading through the the graphic novels right now, and it's just like... Oh, I didn't even read that. Distinguished ways that I took a teak inside. A teak? It was written on with gruesome monsters. As the Uzi family. Uh, I think that means it's a strong uh, dungeon. You're reading graphic novels, though. And I'm, like, falling in love with knives just because the fact that, like, she genuinely seems like she grows so she grows in the movies her personal growth in the movies is fantastic but like her growth in the books is so much more apparent yeah like it wasn't just like oh you broke my heart and that's an experience i went through so i guess like i'm gonna go from it it's genuinely like a she grows from it and i think it's really like okay I got that spider silk. Is it for anything? It slows down alpha. It was cool. Yeah, also, I have the mythical shield. Why did I not equip that to him? Why do you not do a lot of things that you should do? Because you're not my real dad. Why I'm sorry for that. I'm trying my best. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, and this is where we all die horribly. Never mind. <laughs> I was kind of thinking like this might be an endgame dungeon, but clearly not. We're not in the endgame now. Still haven't seen that movie. Stop rubbing it in. That was Infinity War. You've seen Infinity War at least twice. You know what I'm gonna say? No. I don't. What are you gonna say? play as Wallace. <laughs> I'm, I'm, okay, my three choices if I was gonna choose between them was Wallace, Knives, or Kim. Not Steven Stills? You have to say his full name, by the way. I know. <laughs> Unless you're Julie. I was just about to say that! Get out of my head, you freaky <laughs> wizard! <laughs> Yeah, I was going to choose either Knives, Kim, or Wallace, because Wallace is my spirit animal. Yeah. And... This is part Kim can... is also just fantastic. Yeah. I also feel, though, like... If anyone should be in the game... Like, if I had to pick four characters that should be in the game... I would not have picked Steven Stills and Kim. I would have picked Wallace and, and Knives. They feel more at home than Steven Stills and Kim. See? Because Steven Stills is just the guy in the band. And I find it funny because I don't think I ever would have put Wallace there. Really? But he's there. He's For like every fight, the he's one, there. He's always there, but he's always on the sidelines. He is the Futaba of the group. <laughs> yeah. Well, what's going on here? Oh. Fight! <laughs> Notice how he's not in the fight? He's just <laughs> passive palm up here. Hey, what's up with this outfit? <laughs> anyway. Oh, 
Black Goblin. <laughs> Why it gotta be black? That white mage is killing black goblins? Ooh. Not in my backyard. Hello. <laughs> Bailey.exe has stopped responding. I just grabbed onto his tail and held onto it, and he just, like, his back legs just started, like, scooting. White and, and he just, like, dropped to his side. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. But I wasn't doing anything, Bailey! Oh, that's fun. It's an item that casts Blazara, so it's like a scroll in Skyrim. Sweet! <coughs> I think. I forgot that scrolls were even a thing in Skyrim. I don't think I've... I've definitely used one before, at some point. Uh, Jazargo makes you use them. Yeah. But, like, I've never had them and be like, This is gonna be my secret weapon! Um, Desert I... Speed. Obviously I use Jazargo's scrolls. Yeah. But also, too, I did use, um... You can get scrolls of Detect Life. Ah. Uh, which are really useful. I always just sold them. Oh, yeah, they're easy money. <sighs> uh, items. Antidote. Auntie Dote was always my favorite. I was gonna say, relative. you never see Uncle Dote show up. Ha! Get out of my head, you freaky wizard! Okay, do I go <laughs> the other way and not have to fight, or do I fight him? Because if you follow the Fight! Bad guys, if you follow the bad guys, they, like, always lead to the big bad guy. Yeah. They all lead to bad guys. Black goblins. That's just poor taste. White girl in white hood kills black goblins. I was gonna say, I'm like, <laughs> doors me here. <coughs> Don't do that. Ever since I laughed at that joke, my like throat is gone. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <that's> so raunchy. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Use top on the top bar. There's a there's a um, on the top bar. There's a sledgehammer. You want to get rid of some of that. It looks like the Sydney Opera House if it was semi melted. <laughs> Poor wifey's trying to learn how to do roofs on Sim Four, and her house just looks like a catastrophe. <laughs> Okay, as someone who has played three of the four generations of Sims games, though, they the one thing they do not do well is their roof mechanics. Clearly. So, it, like, it's not user-friendly. <laughs> it is user-friendly in, like, the way that it, like, spits in your face because you try to speak native language, and it... <laughs> I feel like I'm just projecting about my experience in uh -huh. Montreal, but... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, <laughs> like, it, it's just not, it's not user-friendly. It's, it's just, it's three different angles of roofs that don't meet up with and each other. And they all, like, kind of awkwardly impale through the other. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's really hard, guys. I'm sorry, honey. You can, like I said, you can use the sledgehammer on the top bar. It just looks so funny. <laughs> Why can't you bring the other roof up to meet it? What's wrong? <laughs> Did you use the altitude thing right there? Bring up the tiniest little... Turn your camera, because you can't even see what it went out. And now let go? Oh, oh, because you brought it too far over. You need to bring it back one. No, 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 leave it up at that height. Now go to the arrow that's pointing that way. No, 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 the other one to the right, to the right, up, 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 to the left. You see that arrow there? Bring it back one square. Wait, one more, come on. Line up the lines. Let's... Yeah. Oh, God, just hit this. <laughs> Alright, you're on your own. Okay, so we're back. 
<laughs> I am so sorry. Oh. <laughs> what was wrong with having that one little overhang section of roof? <laughs> like if you did that one big piece across it, and then you just had like a few, like a little strip where it's extra. I feel so bad. I wish you guys could see what was happening. It's yeah. truly tragic. It really is. She's trying so hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 it's tragic. You know. <laughs> Maybe you should just destroy it and start from scratch and just... One one side of your house is bigger than the rest. Yeah, right? I like, know. It goes out further. Yeah, that's the house that they put you in in this tutorial. What? Thanks, Sims 4. America, explain! <laughs> it's EA, they don't do anything. Except make money! And microtransactions. Uh-huh. And money off the microtransactions, because no matter how stupid it is as a concept, and no matter how much the majority of people hate it, there's still people who do... do... Wow, Jester's taking a beating. <clears throat> Just in the game for now, but keep pushing it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep oh. smack-talking EA, see if they send a hitman at me. Of course they won't. That's funny. Nobody watches my videos anymore. You did? Oh. Just resting your arm. Oh. Baby Jester. He's a kicker. Kick, kick, kick. Wow. Wow. I still see you. You, just, you could've went around that guy. No, oh, I couldn't. Could've. No, oh, I couldn't. Could've. No. Oh. Certainly you could've. Certainly you could've. When this battle is over, walk to your left. What was that? <laughs> I'm sorry I couldn't hear you over the sound of me not being able to walk See, left. See, I told you you couldn't walk left. What are you talking about? You had to fight him. <laughs> <laughs> There's just so many... <coughs> hey look, it's Jamie Foxx, according to me. <laughs> Please explain. <laughs> well, they're called Gloom Widows. And I, earlier I was talking about how I had a gloom, a shiny gloom, named Jamie Fox. I don't know why. I don't know what the context of that was, or why I named it Jamie Fox, but I did. I did that. Wait a second. No! I went downstairs <laughs> in... A mine, uh -huh. and now I'm outside. It's a purple forest. Maybe oh. you're tripping balls, or it's like the Underdark. Do you know what the Underdark is? You have some D&D knowledge, so... It's like, no, I have literally no D&D knowledge. I have no idea what the Underdark is. It's like the second thing you learn about D&D. The first thing is Matthew Mercer. Is it Matthew Mercer, like, the, the voice actor in video games? I don't think so. Maybe he does. I don't I, know. I he could. He'd be really good at it. I'm, I'm going to Google it. By which I mean Bing it. Why would you use Bing? Because it's faster. Bing has an app. Google is Google Chrome. What is he blocking? I think I have to talk to him because he's the only guy that's moving. So I'm a save. I'm gonna let you finish. Whoa, he moved. Oh. Oh. Uh, what was I searching? Matthew Mercer, and whether or not he's a voice actor in the video game. Matthew Mercer. So I'm pretty sure he's the, like... <laughs> Good try, buddy. Try again. There we go. Matthew Mercer. Yeah, he's voice actor extraordinary. He's in everything. I didn't know that. 
Critical Role, Resident Evil Damnation, Resident Evil Vendetta, Mythica, The Dark Spore, Goblins Animated, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Attack on Titan, Mythica, The Godslayer, Mythica, The Necromancer, Mythica, The Iron Crown, Thundercats, Iron Man, Rise of Technoverse, Avengers Assemble, Freedom Fighters, The New Looney Tunes, Marvel Spider Man, Fairy Tale, Dragon Ball Super, Kill a Kill, One Piece Stampede, Voltron, Legendary D, Ultraman, Cow Cowboy Bebop. Cowboy Bebop? Cowboy Bebop. Did I miss something up here? He's. he's I was just weirded out by the fact that he was the only character that moved. But there's nothing up here. Persona 4, the animation. Did you watch the Persona 4 animation? No. You should. It's just, you never see it coming. Nice in Hyrule. Uh, no, that's Persona 4? Not Persona 5. Idiot. Oh. Nice reference, nerd. <laughs> <laughs> there no, is a Persona 5 no. animation too, though. <clears throat> I didn't watch that one either. I was going to, and then I didn't. <laughs> because I like to make bad choices. Oh, Bailey looks so crooked. I'm like scratching he him. Does. But he looks like crooked as sin. Are you done? What? Are you, you done in this stupid dungeon yet? <laughs> This is random encounters, random encounters. Wandering around. What is this, Final Fantasy 1? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Cat's so foofy and soft. Skulger. That's a pretty clever play on ones, what you just say? They certainly tried. Wouldn't you say, grummy old boy? What's going on in the world of Sims 4? Tiny school front. How oh, this garbage truck gonna pick it up? <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to any of those. Wow, okay, there's a lot of... Yeah... Go down the floor? Okay, never mind. Go off the floor. <laughs> I don't know, man. You're on your own. I'ma use Poisona. <laughs> Poisona! Haru explodes through the screen. Forehead first. Oh. No, I was referring to Persona 3. Her forehead is like a 10 gallon hat. <laughs> it makes me laugh every time. <laughs> oh. Do you know anything about Persona 3? Mm, yellow is the primary color of it. No, that's 4. Oh, Idiot. there's a blue. Uh, three, I think, is blue. It's very foggy, it's been a long time. Um, three is the one where they use guns to call their personas. And that was my first exposure to Persona. I went to my friend's house, and he was playing Persona 3, it was new. And I watched him play it for a little while, and he got into a random encounter. And the characters started shooting themselves in the head with guns. And then, instead of their brains getting blown out, it was a Persona. And the persona would use magic, and I, was, I just remember watching it for like 10 minutes straight, not like silently. I just was like, are those high school kids shooting themselves in the heads to call forth demons to use magic for them? I know, right? And he was like, yes. And I was like, I need to play this game. <laughs> you sound like every southern mom. <laughs> are those high school kids blowing their brains out to call demons again? <laughs> Next thing you know, they're going to be reading Harry Potter and playing with those Pokemans. <laughs> oh, right. Jester's been poisoned. Oh, no. I believe him. He'll figure it out. <laughs> Maybe he'll make some stupid, obscure reference, and that'll save him. Spoiler alert, it doesn't. 